A systematic investment plan or SIP is a method that allows you to invest at regular intervals. It allows you to regularly invest in stocks and ETFs just like mutual funds and there is no minimum investment amount. To create a SIP on the Kai tab, tap on orders and then on SIPs, tap on new SIP, enter the name of the SIP and select from the existing baskets. If you don't have existing baskets, tap on new basket. Name the basket and tap on continue. Now tap on the search icon to add stocks or ETFs to the basket. Once the basket is created, select it to link to the SIP. Now select the date and time on which you want the SIP to be executed. You can add up to 5 schedules for any day of the month between 9.30 am and 3 pm with a 30 minute interval. Each time slot allows only one SIP per day. To add another schedule, tap on add. If the schedule date falls on a holiday, the SIP order will be sent to the exchange on the next trading day. Once the schedule is added, swipe to create the SIP. On the SIP screen, you can see all the SIPs you've created along with the status and days to the execution date. Tapping on any SIP will give you the option to pause, edit and delete the SIP. To create a SIP on Kite Web, log in to kite.zerodha.com Click on orders and then on SIPs. Click on create new SIPs and enter the name of the SIP. Select the basket you want to link to this SIP. If you haven't created any basket, create a new basket by clicking on new basket. Name the basket and click on continue. Search to add stocks or ETFs to the basket. Now select the date and time on which you want the SIP to be executed. If you want to add more schedules, click on add. Click on create to finish setting up the SIP. You can check the details like SIP status, execution date, etc. on the SIP screen. Click on menu to edit, pause or delete your SIPs. You will get a reminder on the registered email ID one day before the scheduled SIP date. The funds available in your Zerada account will be used for Kite SIPs. You can also set up automatic fund transfers from your bank account to the Zerada account using e mandate feature on console to ensure that you have sufficient funds on the SIP date. To create an e mandate, visit console.zerada.com and click on create a new mandate. Select the account for which the mandate is to be created. Authenticate the bank account using a debit card or net banking. Follow the on screen instructions to complete the process on the bank's mandate approval gateway. Once the mandate is registered, create a schedule to transfer funds from the Zerada account. It may take up to 5 days for the bank to activate the mandate. To create a schedule, scroll down and name the schedule, select fund transfer date, select the frequency and the amount to be transferred, click on create schedule. There are no charges for e-mandate registrations or e-mandate transactions at Zerada. However, if the transaction fails due to insufficient funds, the bank may charge a penalty.